Now that the inside of the piggy bank is all done, we're going to turn our attention to the outside. So using the 46415-K, one eight quarter inch down cut bit, we're going to go through and cut the outside profile. We're only going to cut about an inch into this material as it is thicker than the bit is able to cut, but I'll talk about that here in just a second. So then using the 46233-K, one sixteenth inch down cut bit, I'm going to go through and mark out all of my screw locations for where we are going to mount the acrylic to. It's really nice to be able to have this on the CNC and the acrylic piece fit absolutely perfectly. Really happy to see that. So I definitely could flip this over and cut through on the backside, but I do find it easier to just move over to the bandsaw, cut through the remainder of the material, and then we'll move over to the router table and use the 47090 quarter inch diameter flush trim bit. And this is just going to take care of that last little bit that is left there to get everything nice and flushed up. This bit did a great job, leaving really nice clean cuts. So definitely nice to see that, but we'll get to more on this on the next one. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Have a great day, everybody.